The availability of purified water and the ease of which to obtain it has evolved over the years. When comparing alkaline water vs. distilled water, specifically, each are effective water filtering processes, although each follows a different method. Diving deeper into the comparison of both will help to reveal why these two water purification methods are so popular today and how businesses can stay competitive by making these options available as a perk or amenity. Today, we're going to talk about the difference between alkaline water vs. distilled water. Now let's start the video to better understand. People like alkaline water because it neutralizes the acidity in the body by increasing the pH level of tap water. Typically speaking, regular drinking water has a pH level of 7. Alkaline water normally registers 8 or 9 on the pH scale of 0 14. It's sold by the bottle and health food in specialty stores, and commercial water ionizers are available to accommodate businesses. On an individual basis, simply adding lemon or lime juices to water can cause water to be alkaline as the body digests it. Many people who enjoy drinking alkaline water experience health benefits, such as support to the immune system and aid in detoxification. While greater scientific research is needed to verify these claims, staying hydrated does benefit a person's health. Despite its benefits, the main differentiator is the change to the water's pH level. The water distillation process achieves what ionizing water does not. By collecting water vapor through its heating method, it leaves behind harmful contaminants, such as bacteria, viruses, and chemicals including chromium, lead, and arsenic. Unfortunately, it also removes valuable minerals from the water as well, many of which are beneficial to your body. Because of this, the taste of distilled water is often described as flat which leaves something to be desired for anyone who wants to increase their daily water intake. Not all cities have the same quality of tap water. Some systems are even deemed non-potable, leaving many without access to clean and pure water for drinking or cooking. When not drinking from the tap, the easy solution for decades has been to rely on bottled water instead. This option is costly to the environment and is not a sustainable solution for large organizations. Replenishing a bottled water supply can become expensive, difficult to coordinate, and lead to an undesirable experience for all. Distilled water is the result of the process of boiling tap water and then subsequently condensing the vapor back into water. Whereas alkaline water is water that has been filtered to increase the pH level of the water making it less acidic and adding minerals rather than removing them. The process of distillation removes all minerals from the water and aims to reduce the number of total dissolved solids at TDS to zero. This can be a concern, though, because mineralization in water is an important component for human health. Lots of people ask, is distilled water alkaline? But there are two completely different concepts of water purification, and this is primarily based on minerals. Mineral content in water such as calcium, magnesium, and other components protect against deficiencies by providing adequate intake which can often be missing from many contemporary diets. The only thing people like more than options is the ability to have all of the above. There are benefits from drinking both alkaline and distilled water, but each has its drawbacks as well. Comparing two strong competitors is not just an easy task. However, we've done a little, but choose yours according to your preferences. This video is just to help over the topic. Hope this video helped you out. Thanks for watching till the end.